One day, minha avó took me to the beach. It was on a Saturday and the beach was crowded. As soon as I sat on the sand, I noticed two men chatting about the beach's curse. A curse! They said mermaids used to sink ships in that beach and sometimes you could still hear them singing. Minha avó heard and told me it was just a tale to make people go away so the beach would be less crowded. But I wasn't convinced. So I sat down in a rock nearby and spent the whole morning trying to hear the mermaids sing. But no matter how hard I tried, I couldn't hear anything. Then some girls nearby broke my mm. concentration. Hey Peter Pan, you want a lollipop? What did you call me? You look like someone out of a fairy tale. Do you want to hang out with us? Mm, okay. So they gave me a lollipop, but it was too salty. I had to throw it away without them noticing. Then they took me to a snack bar in front of the beach and started calling me cute. I think one of them wanted me to kiss her like I had seen other boys doing before. My heart was racing. I didn't know how to kiss someone. If I had kissed before, I would not have been so scared. Luckily, Mia Vo showed up to save me. Oh, here you are. I was looking for you. Let's go home. At night, I dreamed I was on the beach's rock. Help! When I saw one of the girls drowning, so I jumped in the water to rescue her, but she was no longer there. Then I noticed I couldn't breathe underwater. I couldn't remember how I ended up there, and I had left the beach already, so I must be dreaming. As soon as I became lucid, a fish showed up. Have you seen someone drowning around here? It was me. What? Are you like a mermaid or something? I'm a guardian of nature. Oh, let me guess, let me guess. You carry the water element. That's none of your business. Why are you in a bad mood? You're polluting my water right now. I'm really sorry about the lollipop. I'm talking about the water inside you. I don't understand. Oh, let me help you. I woke up. Did I just get kissed by some sort of mermaid? That was so weird and made no sense. At school, I kept thinking about the girl I met on the beach. Maybe now I would have the courage to ask her out. A week later, Mia Vá took me to the beach again and I saw the same girl in there. We chatted all morning and later I had my first real life kiss. A few days passed and I had another lucid dream. A bird told me you kissed a girl. How was it? Okay, I guess. And you want to kiss her again? Mm, yep. <laughs> <laughs> What's so funny? I'm just finding hilarious that you can remember who you are. One time I met a druid who told me that she would. <laughs> I lost my lucidity for a moment, but I'm back. I know, mother brought you back. I'm impressed you can still listen to the wind after everything that you lost. What were you saying about me before? If you didn't hear, then it's not the time for you to hear. That makes my life so much easier. <laughs> Goodbye. Hold on, I want to know. What do you want to know? She said I can't remember who I am and I think she was going to help me out with that. And why don't you help yourself with that? How? If you can answer that by now, then she's right. And I've already said more than I should. Just give me a clue. The blindest man or woman is the one who refuses to see. I wish you peace and light. I woke up and I was pretty confused about the dream I just had, but I still took notes of it in my dream journal in case it wouldn't become useful in the future. I pasted some dream photos in there too. Wait, photos? I was too asleep and had to wake up again. <sighs> Days later, I was coming back from school when I saw the girl I had kissed and she was kissing another Girl, I had thought she liked me. She saw me and tried to explain herself, but I was very upset. She ruined the dream life I was planning to have with her. I thought about her the whole day, and at night she showed up in my dreams. I'm here to say I'm sorry I betrayed you. I thought you liked me. Yes, I do. I'm ashamed. Please forgive me. I won't do it again. I promise. Let's have wet dreams together. Okay. Gotcha! <laughs> Thanks for
for watching my video. In the next video, I talk about the day I screwed up and I was grounded in my dreams. So make sure you subscribe to my channel to not miss any story. If you want to know more, make sure you watch my other videos too. And don't forget to leave a comment and a like. Thanks, bye!